And this would be a total game changer. So uh, I want to advance groundbreaking opportunity for individuals throughout the state by putting this plan that I've just described into effect. Okay, Dennis? Well, uh, number one, I don't believe that uh, white supremacy is the main problem that working people face in this country. I believe it's the workings of capitalism, class against class. Uh, most Caucasian workers, they're not white supremacists. Across this country, the Socialist Workers Party works in states all across this country. I was born and raised in Minnesota. I think there's less racism today than there was 30 or 40 years ago because of the civil rights movement. Because well, I wasn't talking about racism. I was talking about fascism. Okay, let me talk about Yeah. All right. Yeah. Uh, I don't also believe that the use of the term fascism applies today. Fascism is what the capitalist governments in the past, the rulers have turned to when there's no other way in which to rule. Uh, that's what we saw in Germany. When the crisis was so deep uh, that the workers' movement had to be destroyed in order to allow uh, a fascist regime uh, to, to control, to destroy all democracy and to control and become the government itself. Fascism then, how was fascism the rise of it fought in the 1930s when the, the CIO was being built, when the labor movement was in its ascendancy? Well, the Teamsters in Minneapolis had a very good example. They, they formed what was called Workers' Defense Guards, made up of working people practicing not violence, but self-defense to defend themselves and other working people. These are broad committees uh, against the rise and violence by fascist-type thugs. Uh, this will have to be done again. I don't believe we face fascism now, but I do believe as the crisis in this capitalist system continues to deepen in the years ahead, we will face a question of a fascist threat. Workers will either take power in this country or fascism will reign. The rulers will turn to fascism when they no longer think electoral politics works, when they have to turn to thugs in the street. And by the way, I think these fascist troops will come from both left and right. We've seen it already today. It comes from people who are who feel violence, who feel threats of violence, whether it's anti-fox.